Was it the voice? Was it the fire burning in me? All of the noise turned into choirs of harmony. Left me with the pieces of forever that you broke. But since you left me alone, I've been high. The Dynasty A-Flow Fallon Sherrick Darts Review starts right now. Hey, what's up guys? Worldwide here. We got a great video for you today. And you know what? I was just having a quick browse over on YouTube. To my surprise, there really wasn't any Fallon Sherrick Darts Reviews. So what do you say we fix that in this video? We'll be taking a close up look at her Dynasty A-Flow Fallon Sherrick Darts. Now, a quick backstory with these darts. A couple weeks ago, I was browsing over on Dart Shopper. And by the way, all the links to her darts will be down in the pinned comment if you want to check them out there. But yeah, I was browsing over at Dart Shopper. I happened to notice a few different models with her darts. She has some 95% tungsten darts. However, those were a little bit heavier. As you guys know, I prefer a lighter dart. So I found these. These are the 80% tungsten version. And they came in a little bit lighter, 21 grams. But the best part about all her darts they practically all have the same dimensions. It doesn't matter if they're 21 grams and 80% tungsten darts or 95% tungsten and 24 grams. So yeah, all the same dimensions. So I ended up going with these and best of all, they were about $30 cheaper than her 95% tungsten darts. So yeah, what with these things, super nice darts as you guys are about to see. So I won't keep you waiting any longer. Let's grab the other camera. We'll take a close up look over some stats and dimensions and then my favorite part of the video, take them to the board for a little bit, throw them for a few turns, and then I'll let you guys know what I think of the Dynasty A-Flow Fallon Sherrick Dart. So yeah, should be a good review, guys. Here we go. Alrighty, let's take a look at what we have here. So the darts come in this very compact cardboard hand case. Nothing too fancy there. The darts, the stems, the flights were on this um, felt thingamajiggy there. But the darts themselves, super nice. We've got the um, laser etched points. We've got the beautiful barrels, polycarbonate stem, and our standard A-Flow flight. But what do you say we get a little bit closer look and we'll go over some stats and dimensions. Okay, there we go. Great looking setup. Everything from these laser etched points. We've got the beautiful barrels, the intermediate length polycarbonate stems, as well as the standard size A-Flow flight. But writing down some stats and dimensions, these are an 80% tungsten barrel. The barrel length coming in at 48.5 millimeters long and the barrel width right on this blue multi ring as you see right here maximum width 7.2 millimeters wide and obviously it tapers down quite a bit to the front and tapers down going towards the stem as well now these were advertised as 21 grams awesome match weight in here first one went on the scale 21.04 21.05 and 21.06. It's only two one hundredths of a gram off. That's some excellent match weighting. So well done to Dynasty there. But what do you say? We get a little bit closer look at these barrels and these points. Okay, let's get a little bit closer look at the barrels. And again, I'll start on the front end with a laser etch points. Kind of nice to see Dynasty offering some upgraded points on their darts. I wish more companies did that getting tired of these silver points but yeah there's the laser etch points I think those are going to stick in the board really well but looking at the front end you can see it tapers way down so you're going to be grouping these things really tight and it even tapers right there at the front where the point meets the barrel so that's going to help save or help preserve your flights but you know what looking at this barrel you wouldn't think it's all that grippy right just a basic multi-ring dart however these darts are a lot more grippy than they appear. You know, I'm gonna go ahead and give these a level three grip on a scale of one to five. I think if you had really soft hands, which I don't, you could probably go level three and a half grip. So yeah, surprisingly grippy for a multi-ring dart. And then on the back end here, where is it? We've got the Fallon logo there. 
So, uh, yeah, that's about it, guys. Pretty basic dart. However, a lot more grippy than it looks. So what do you say we get these things on the board? And I'm um, very curious to see how I'll be able to throw them. So here we go. Whew, sweating already after just a couple minutes warm up. But uh, yeah, just been throwing these things probably for six or seven turns. There's three things I want to point out. Now, I just mentioned it in the last clip, but the grip on here, the grip surprises me. Throwing these things, like I said, for the last couple minutes, man, the, um, the tops of the multi rings, they really bite into your fingertips. So uh, yeah, some, a little, you know, kind of a sharp edge on this grip, I would imagine. It was funny though, because when I was looking at the pictures over on Dart Shopper, before I bought these things, I didn't expect, I'm gonna go for uh, 18s, that one's kind of blocked. Oh, get in, but yeah, I wasn't expecting a grippy dart, you know, looking at the pictures, and probably the same thing with you guys looking at the video, just a multi-ring dart, you don't expect them to be quite that grippy. Usually like the small multi-rings, maybe like a level two grip, easy level three on these things. Like I said, if you have soft hands, probably a three and a half level grip. Now, the second thing, you guys are probably gonna laugh, but, oh, hold on a second. Yeah, pre-boom, get in there. All right, so this second thing, and I think I can consider myself a little bit of a tungsten snob, 80% tungsten, right? And I won't name any companies or any other companies, but there are some 80% tungsten barrels out there and they just feel cheap. When you clang them, when you clang them together, they sound hollow and they just kind of feel like crap. And then when you clang them together in the board, they just have that weird kind of cheap hollow sound. Not the case with these things. If you're actually to hand me these darts and I was to check them out, I would swear they are at least 90% tungsten barrels, if not 95% tungsten. They just feel that nice. And they have that nice, it's just a nice dense sound, if that makes sense. I hope it does. But yeah, as you see, they're throwing incredibly well. I'm going to go cover shot again. Ooh, 98. Okay, so the third thing, you guys know that I have a brand new dartboard hanging on the wall. These points, the laser edge points, I thought they might harm the dartboard, but it's just the perfect amount of grip on these things. They, uh, they hold in the board incredibly well and they're not pulling out any fibers. They're not harming my brand new dartboard at all. So Dynasty knocked it out of the park with these points. These things are super nice. I'd maybe like to see them a little bit longer, but nonetheless, great set of points here. Ooh, cover. Get under there. Ugh. <laughs> but you know what? Considering that I don't review too many barrels shaped like this, um, they throw really easy, no complaints there. Um, actually, my grip, pointer finger and thumb, right behind the blue multi ring in the middle of the barrel, with that 7.2 millimeter thickness, I'm right behind that with my grip. I think it works good for a mid gripper, definitely a rear gripper like myself, probably not so much with a front gripper just because of the way these barrels taper. Oh, that one's stuck to my fingers. Oh. Whew. Oh, I thought I hit a 26 there for a second. 36. Well, that's an average killer. Started out good, didn't it? <laughs> All right, last throw. Concentrate a little bit. Oh, come on. Let's see if I can go right over the top. Hmm, get in. And there we have it. Yeah, really no complaints about this. I think Dynasty did a great job. And uh, yeah, it's just an awesome set of darts. So um, I'm not even really sure. They're, they're very similar to what she throws right now. But I believe she throws a 23 gram dart. I'm not sure if you know what, if you know what weight she plays with, let me know down in the comment section. But um, there we go, guys. Awesome set of barrels. Had really fun throwing them right there. Always nice to see a pre-boom. Although we do have one more clip and you know what's coming, so let's change my shirt and here we go.
that's standing up, but it's low in the bed. Oh, good deflection. <laughs> that wasn't the prettiest 180, but I'll take it. Boom. So first, all right, there's the third dart and the first dart right down the center, then this weird deflection up in the corner. However, some deflections do count. I will take that. So great place to end the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed the close-up look at the Dynasty A-Flow Fallon Sherrick darts. Now, another reminder, all the links to Dart Shopper and all her darts and flights and other accessories will be down in the pinned comment. So make sure you check them out there. Also keep an eye out. I think they're going to be having some sales coming up pretty soon. So yeah, Dart Shopper link down in the pinned comment. If you did enjoy the video, please feel free to leave a thumbs up and hey, comment down below as well. Until next time, guys, we will see you on the next video. Later.